Set. Recording. All right. We're recording, and we got it. Okay. So, here it is. David off Cool Water. Hopefully you saw my previous video on this. It was my first impression. Uh, amazing fragrance. Absolutely love it, especially on first impression. I was surprised because I blind bought it, and usually I don't like my blind buys. So, this is going to be more of an actual review on this fragrance. So, yeah. Here we go. So, uh, I left a link in the description for the notes, but I'm going to give you a few of them. The top notes are mainly lavender, mint, those sort of green notes. And then I know as a middle note, they have sandalwood. But yeah, a lot of those green notes are very airy, very, um, very great smelling for, uh, notes that go into the fragrances. One thing um, that I, one way I would like to describe it is like, I think of it as a body wash almost. I know that sounds bad. And I said that in the previous video, but it smells just very like masculine smelling, not super um, like out there and something that you might be uncomfortable wearing. This is a very, I think generally a masculine, almost every guy would love wearing this and love this fragrance, especially for the summer and springtime, uh, cause it doesn't punch super well, but I'll get to that in a second. It also, the one thing I like about it more than other frag or like those sort of springtime fragrances is that it is a bit more masculine. So like Nautica Voyage and Tommy Bahama, as much as I absolutely love them, they do have some of those more fruity notes that um, make it more of a scent that you could smell in just a good smelling room. Like it doesn't necessarily, they don't have very many qualities that make it a cologne, but this is very much a cologne smelling smell. So I absolutely love it and I love that about it. So it is very masculine. Now, quick little story with this. I was a bit nervous about the performance beforehand because um, the sheet fragrances sometimes they just make me worry. Um, even though synthetic stuff sometimes does last really well. Uh, but you know, I just didn't know if I maybe got a bad bottle or something. But yeah, I sprayed it on. I was having trouble, like I couldn't smell it. I did five sprays, I couldn't smell it after like a little, even like an hour. But that I think I just got used to the smell because I went to this whole family party thing and I was like, dang, I got no compliments. But then while I was at the party, I asked my sister, I was like, what do you think of this? So I let her smell my wrist or my neck, I can't remember. And she was like, oh yeah, I smelled that earlier on you when we hugged, I was, she was like, I absolutely love it. And then when, as soon as she said that, my siblings uh, or my sister-in-law was like, oh yeah, I love that. I could smell it when you walked by earlier. I, have, I thought it smelled amazing. And then I was like, oh, perfect. So apparently everyone had smelled it, just no one really said anything. So. But they also, they loved it. As a matter of fact, I got my brother to buy it because his wife loved it so much. So he went ahead and bought it on Amazon as well. So yeah, great fragrance. Lots of guys and girls love it. Very safe is what I would say. I would say that if you're into fragrances, like new fragrances, I would go for this one, especially if you're introducing it to more aquatic and green note type fragrances. This is what I would go for. Uh, this, and I also like Nautica Voyage, but this is a bit more cologne-like. Sometimes people get Nautica Voyage and then they're disappointed that it's not as masculine as they had hoped. So I do love this one. I absolutely love it. Uh, yeah, performance. As far as I know, it's great. I couldn't smell it myself, but it lasted like people could still smell it after when I was at the thing. It probably been maybe five hours. So yeah, pretty good, especially for the price. Yeah, you can buy it. It's about, I think this was 4.2 ounce, I think. Something like that. Yeah, 4.2 ounces, 125 milliliters, and it was about $23 on Amazon, um, maybe even cheaper. And you can probably get it discounted. Uh, but yeah, I'll leave a, li a link in the description below as long as with the notes. Uh, it also has um, uh, 6.2 ounce, I think. That's about 30 bucks, so I'd recommend buying that because I think you'll love it. But if you don't and you just want to try it out, just pay for the cheaper one. You'll probably like it, and later on you can just buy the bigger one. But yeah, I'll leave the link in the description below. David off, cool water, eau de toilet. Yeah, amazing fragrance, 10 out of 10. One easily one of my new favorites. So uh, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you in the next video, which I'm not sure what it will be. Yet. I have a few things planned, but yeah, I have a few I want to buy, um, test them out, do some different video styles as well, uh, get some things going. So. Gonna be more consistent. I'm gonna try and post two or three times a week.